known as the Ninja Killer is set to be executed this evening. Louis Gaskin will be the second execution in Florida this year signed by Governor Ron DeSantis. On your side's Taylor Levesque is live tonight from Florida State Prison with a look at why hundreds are gathered outside the prison walls. Taylor. Yeah, a lot more people starting to show up and now uh, many right now are getting ready to hold a vigil in a peaceful protest ahead of Louis Gaskin's execution that's scheduled for a little under an hour. I'll move out of the way. You can see a lot of people are showing up, uh, setting up chairs, blankets on the ground, getting ready to peaceful protest and hold the vigil tonight. Gaskin is called the ninja killer because he wore all black ninja clothing during the crimes he committed. He was convicted of shooting and killing 56 year old Robert Sturmfeld and 55-year-old Georgette Stumfels in 1989 at their home in Flagler County. Flagler County Sheriff's Office says and on the same night, he committed an armed robbery and burglary and attempted murder of another couple. Gaskins confessed to the murders and he filed numerous appeals over the years but was unsuccessful according to court documents. Again, this execution scheduled for a little under an hour. Um, you can see in the distance people even holding up signs, chairs, and blankets as they're getting ready. Uh, for this vigil tonight. We'll have more coming up at the six o'clock hour. In Rayford, Taylor Levesque, First Coast News on your side. Taylor, thank you. Develop